So um, this video is to walk you through the installation of the, the complete harmonic pattern scanner. So essentially the the uh, complete harmonic pattern um, indicator will pretty much um, give you uh, illustrations on a complete harmonic patterns meaning of it will give you all five points which are X A B C and D uh, that pretty much makes up uh, a complete pattern so let's get started so first thing you want to do is um, open up your um, MT4 broker of your choice again it doesn't matter if it's a demo or live account nor does it matter which uh, broker it is so go ahead and open up your MT4 account once you do that um, minimize um, you're gonna go into the file that was downloaded in your computer you're gonna come across this um, file double click and double click again and then you're gonna go into files so again I like to start off with uh, the template so we're gonna click on template and we are going to right click and left click to copy now we're gonna open up our MT4 software uh, select um, file and left click and open select uh, open data folder left click once you come across these files uh, you're gonna find uh, templates once you do that uh, open it up by double clicking and once you come across um, these files you want to uh, right click on your mouse and left click to paste the uh, indicator that we just copied from the download since um, this file this template's already downloaded it's already installed in this file it's asking me to replace I'm gonna select um, replace the file in this destination So close this, uh, minimize your MT4, uh, go back. Uh, next thing we're going to do is uh, open up the MQL4 file, double click to open. Uh, the indicator is a bonus. Uh, you may or may not want to install this, I choose not to, but it's your choice. Uh, uh, select experts uh, double click to open from here you're gonna hold your your left click uh, on the mouse so hold it and drag up and then release to uh, to select the two files uh, in the blue section you want to right click and select copy by left clicking on your mouse so at this point you could uh, close this uh, folder and we're going to go back into our MT4 software uh, open it up and the same process again uh, click on file 
and select open data folder so now we're going to look for the mql4 file so once you do that you're gonna double click to open and next task is to find the experts file so apparently it's always going to be your first file so double click to open that folder so once you come across this um, right click and paste from the files that we copy from again uh, since I already have these uh, files installed uh, all I'm doing is replacing um, but if if um, in your situation where uh, you haven't done this uh, this window is not going to appear for you so I'm going to replace the, the files once that is done uh, close this window on tools open up tools and select uh, options by left clicking and under expert advisors uh, you want these two boxes to be checked the first one and the fifth one uh, make sure that is checked and hit OK okay so once that is done we are going to look for this uh, icon with the folder and a star it's called the navigator we're gonna uh, left click to open and under indicators we want to select this by left clicking and then right click once this window uh, pops up you're gonna left click to refresh so once that happens we're gonna minimize this and at this time you pretty much want to open up a new chart uh, the way you do that is by going into this icon with the plus signal, uh, green plus signal, uh, left click and then select your first first chart that you see it doesn't really matter which chart it is, which pair it is uh, so open that up uh, you might want to maximize it and the the scanner the dashboard scanner is going to be this this um, expert file right here. So we are going to double click. So it's asking us to um, to update. Uh, we just want to follow the instructions. So it says. Um, Please restart your MT4 and reset attach and reattach your expert to the chart again. So we're going to close everything. And we are going to open our MT4 software. We're going to start the process again. We're going to open a chart, uh, maximize, uh, select select this uh, navigator icon. From there, we're going to open up the scanner, which, which is this right here.
Yeah, I'm not sure why it's doing that, but um. So this is the the current version, the 1.6. So now it says um. The expert is active. Hit OK. So um since. Since this is the weekend, um, basically the the scanner doesn't work on the weekends. It's it's only available when when uh, the market is open. But um, I found a way to uh, make it work. So so pretty much. Um, Pretty much, uh, I found a way to to make it work on the weekend, since um, the scanner is meant to only work when the market is open, which is five days. And the way you enable your scanner to work on the weekends is by opening this this um, this software right here. And I'll probably make another video on how to install this and where to install and how to install this and where to download it. So it pretty much uh, tricks your um, your MT4. And there we go. It's now working. So at this time you you hit um, scan market so the default parameters it's the one hour um, the four hour and the daily uh, charts so that's pretty much on the time frames that the scanner is uh, scanning for by default. Uh, you do have the option to scan on the one minute, the five minute, the fifteen minute, and the thirty minutes, and even the weekly and the monthly. And I'll probably show you how to do that once on uh, the scanner it's. Uh, done scanning also uh, when the market is scanning um, you don't want to mess with the software uh, just let it be since it does say please wait okay so uh, once the scanner is done uh, scanning for potential harmonic patterns you are going to open the chart by selecting view so here is a bat pattern on on UJ if you want to go back to the scanner dashboard you go back to that chart the first chart that that we open then if you want to go to the second uh, potential harmonic pattern that the scanner scan us for you select view and the pattern will pop up as a new chart uh, pretty much do the same for the for the uh, rest of the patterns that you see. Um, as I said, I was going to show you how to change the uh, parameters regarding the time frame. So we're going to right click. We're going to go into Expert Advisors and left click on Properties. And then we're going to go into inputs. 
and this section right here it's where it allows you to modify the uh, time frames that you wanna that you want the scanner to scan for so as I said um, you have you can scan for the one minute the five minutes and the 15 minutes the 30 minutes and so on and so forth uh, let's just scan for 15 minutes so if you have multiple time frames make sure you separate them with the comma otherwise um, it's not going to scan so let's just uh, scan the market for 15 minute time frame and select OK so since we we change the parameters to to um, scan the market for only 15 minutes. That's pretty much what the software is doing now. It's only concentrating on 15 minute time frames. And there you guys have it. So these these four are 15 minute patterns. Again, if you want to see the pattern, hit view and a new chart will pop up.